All right, everybody, welcome back to DIY, brought to you by our weekly sponsors, The Like Button, check it out down there, and also my clothing line, once again, at QCAthletics.com, because we have lots of restonks on joggers. So many joggers to go around, and the new color blocking shorts, restocks on other things, and of course, I am, as I always do, I'm, I'm wearing the joggers, because, I mean, unless they're all in the wash, which is getting more difficult, because I just got more with this batch, they're, look, Look at the orange ones. Look, so much real estate in the pockets for items. More than before, okay? So check it out. And now back to our regularly scheduled programming. Let's start off with number 19. This and the music makes me want to drive into a, a digger. I, oh, I was like, I've never heard that as an expression before. Like, drive off a bridge, drive off a cliff. Nope, drive into a, a digger. I'm not gonna listen to the music because uh, I don't, I don't want to do copyrights, but yeah, okay, yeah. No, you know, I love to put Mickey Mouse ears on my car so that I it makes the car wider effectively and I can have a harder time parking, squeezing through tight spaces. No, definitely the best thing to do is just have heavy machinery knock off your existing side mirror and replace it with something gigantic like that. I mean, it, I'm sure it will help for being able to avoid curbing your wheel. Never want to do that. And this way you can just have a little bit more visibility to, to view up while you still can include your wheel down there. That is, by the way, the trick to parallel parking. If you don't want to curb your wheel on the curb, just make sure your mirror is tilted down and then you get perfect visibility of how much distance you have between yourself and the curb. And then you never have to curb your wheel again because it's always painful when you do that. Tampon earrings. Hmm. But why though? Why are you, do why are you doing that? No, uh, no, 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 huh, huh. Okay, I mean, look, I get it. She has like, she's 18,000 likes on that thing. So there's an audience there living off of these sorts of zany ideas, but it's a good question that the top comment brings up, which is if it rains, what's gonna, what's gonna happen there, huh? Gonna expand a little bit and also just you just like it's a fishing hook string and a I mean by that standard I could just grab any old how why don't I get some q-tips I'll just get some q-tips make sure to pierce my ears first and then I'll just dangle those down I covered hot wings in 24 karat gold and was told it belonged here that sounds expensive is that expensive to do also it just looks like you took gold foil and just balled it up rather than coating some chicken wings in. Is that edible? Because occasionally you see food items that have gold flakes put on them. So would you just have really extravagant looking fingernails after this? Because that's where the gold ends up, right? It's in, your, it's in your fingernails, I think. Something like that. So, wow, very stylish. Excuse me. Oh man, I hate it when the shifter just falls off of my car. What can we... Let me just quit, what? Okay, all right. I like how he just like nonchalantly pulls out the entire housing of the, the shift lever. It's like not just the shift lever itself. He straight up, he goes in there. I don't even know what that's called. It's some component of the transmission, but just like, oh, no problem. If you want to do this, just, Weld something down in there, easy. I'll show it to you for half a second. You should be able to get the full grasp of what you need to do. And then just stick a bicycle seat on there. Make sure you spray paint it so that when it gets hot, you can get paint all over your hand and it'll, it'll be good. But they lit it with a lighter. You just need to make a, a bigger flame than one match can possibly handle. No finger burns. Oh, okay. I mean, I guess if that's a real big concern for you, like, you know, you, you can also, I, I, I do like the fact that they, <laughs> they demonstrated by lighting it with a lighter, which kind of defeats the purpose, which why did you need the match if you had the lighter in the first place? But assuming you actually strike it on the matchbox, I, I guess, or you could just, I don't know not hold it after it burns to your finger. That's the other thought. You just blow it out. But I get it. Infuriating resin ashtray. Add some dirt laying around. Decided to add it to the resin. 
this has to be a joke, right? And you're like, what, what should I put inside of my DIY homemade ashtray, I guess? Well, I guess ash is gonna be in it, so why don't I just make it look like it's never clean at all? Even if it's clean, it won't look clean, so when I knock out the ash into it, then it'll just, it'll hardly change, right? For sale in the neighborhood, kitchen spoon set, $55. $55, huh? I mean, I guess depending upon your, you could potentially have a very high hourly rate. Whatever you do for a living, might actually generate lots of money, but you just aren't aren't quite there in the art department yet. But you're like, hey, my hourly rate's still pretty high. So, you know, that's gotta be worth something here. I put a lot of time into gluing these beads onto these spoons. So somebody better pay to appreciate that time and effort I put in there. You know, I, hey, I bet you that when you spin that around and swirl it and mix, if you're using it to mix something, those extra beads and stuff probably do a better job mixing until one of them falls off and then you accidentally eat it in whatever you cookie that you baked. And, that or you break your tooth on it. This will definitely become the new kitty litter box. Wait, is it a It's a it's a cat maze underneath a bed? That's actually kind of cool. Would it really become a litter box? I feel like cats are pretty cats are pretty solid about what they do for a litter box. I don't know. I don't hate this. Seems kind of it's unnecessary because I feel like you don't need your cat going and hiding underneath your bed. And then you're like, so where's the cat? Did the cat run away? And then you have to somehow like knock on the bed and hope that the cat comes running out. But I don't think the cat would use it as a litter box. Like once the cats have their litter box established, they're pretty good at sticking to it, I think. Yes, let's turn this fruit into a ring. Are you, wait, is, you're gonna... It's okay. It's like... Five minute crafts has, uh, man, they've turned it into five second crafts here. This is next level thoughts on their part. Okay, here's the deal. You can't afford that engagement ring that you've been looking for. Okay, well, you know what? As long as you give it to her, tell her, oh, you know, I didn't size it yet. I just needed to get it resized. And you only, you do it right fresh. You do this two minutes before she sees it, you propose, and you're like, okay, I gotta take it back so we can get it resized. Tell me your size. I didn't want to ask you before because that would have spoiled it. You'd have been like, why does he want to know my ring size? And then you say, ah, oh, shoot, I accidentally flushed it down the toilet. God dang it, I'll never be able to get it back. Now, that was a lot of money I just wasted. Shrek pooping toothpaste. I don't know, you might want to get that checked by a doctor. I feel like uh, white. Coming out the back uh, isn't isn't the healthiest sign. It would be interesting though. It would be, if you turned around and it was white down there. I feel like it would be more of a you do a double take versus if there's I don't know red or something. You're con immediately concerned. If it was white, you'd be like. Although maybe there's a reason that can happen. I'm not entirely sure, but this was definitely a. Uh, tangent that we didn't need to go down. Sorry about that. Trash robot. It just, it looks, it's just something that, that exists in, in like a, a show. And it's really, really scary the first time that the, the protagonist sees it. And there's like a dark silhouette at the end of the hall. And then finally it just crawls out into the light. It's like, no, just please. I can't put me out of my misery, please. I don't, I'm not hostile. You really think I can do anything to you? All right, you think, you think this has the capacity to like take a swing at you or something? No, just please. I don't want to be here anymore. I love a red with notes of industrial adhesive. This is going to be a um, DIY wine. DIY wine? That should be another. Did you just make a just make a cup out of tape? Did you just put the but you put the adhesive on the What did you do in order to make it so that you're not just pouring the wine into the adhesive component of the Does Does anyone really buy a bottle of wine and then go, "Oh shoot. I just remembered." 
We don't have any anything at home to drink out of. No cups, nothing like that, not even a bowl. But we do have tape. Look at how crusty and stiff it makes her hair. Is this like DIY hair dye? Why are you putting toothpaste in your hair? Five minute crafts, what are you doing? I liked it more when it was a five second video of a pomegranate. What? Is this like a whitening toothpaste that has hydrogen peroxide and actually like bleaches your hair? And makes it really gross? Like how the comb, the, you're, they're combing through it and you just, you just see the texture. Oh God. I hate everything about this. A new challenger has approached in the, <laughs> wait, we have a, a link from the PewDiePie. Is this original content from the PewDiePie submissions subreddit? It's crossing over into DIY. Oh my god. Oh my god, did you make a bean Furby? I'm be honest. This is a this is very impressive original content. Oh my goodness. Can you pass the salt before it falls into the trough again, please? It's actually kind of cool. A little impractical because now you like you have two hazards that you have to worry about like something could spill towards you and it could also just spill into the pond and then what you could have your wine spill into the pond and you're like ah shoot the wine's just contaminated my entire water flow this sucks now you have to drain all the water out clean the filter it seems like a a little impractical even if it looks pretty cool perfect cement ideas for your crafty days Oh God, it's just, it's just gonna be, it's just another montage of unnecessary concrete and cement. That's just another, yes, I love cementing my flowers. <laughs> it's like a candied apple, except without the fun of it being edible and looking worse. I, I do love concreting my flowers. Just add concrete to everything. We've, we've really upgraded here from hot gluing everything to just concreting everything. <laughs> just why? Why have you concreted fabric? What is this? No. No, that doesn't look good at all. I thought it was going to be a basket. I was like, maybe that's acceptable, but no. Oh, God. A concrete hand. All the better to slap someone with. Please. Nope. It's gonna be concrete hands to hold a thing of rocks. That doesn't... They had to do it from that angle because it was just gonna look bad from any other one with the hands just crushed. Oh god. I'm good. No thank you. If you want to watch the full thing, go for it. These golden bedazzled crocs that I made. I mean... At least you're embracing it, right? I feel like... I feel like nobody buys Crocs thinking that it's a fashion statement and they kind of realize that it looks a bit silly. So... Doing the... Ah! Uh, I was more of a fan when it was just the, the gold spray paint. The bedazzling might be a little bit excessive. I went on a drive the other week and one of the people was wearing Crocs and driving a manual transmission car and I was very impressed with it. I've got to say, like, for driving manual, you want to have not like a slip-on loose shoe, especially if you're going to be doing heel-toe. And this man's, this man's just going for it, wearing Crocs. And I got to say I was impressed and also concerned. And the top for the last month of DIY. Okay, but why though? I mean, isn't that the question for all these? Once your teeth are shaved down, it can't be undone and will likely result in a lifetime of expensive treatments. Teeth shaving TikTokers will need dentures by their 40. No. No, 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 no. No, 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 nobody. Nobody did this. Nobody did this. No, this, they're wearing dent, they're wearing like a set of dentures. Please tell me they were please tell me they didn't do this. Please tell me nobody actually went and did this. Please, 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 please. 
No, 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 no. Oh my god. Oh my god. Tick tock tooth teeth shaving. What is happening? Veneers check. What? No, please tell me it's not real. Please tell me it's not real. It, as part of the process of people getting their... Wait, people were actually... I know that you have to shave... I know that your teeth get shaved down if you're... Okay, anyway. I hope it's... I hope it's fake. Oh my god, I hope it's fake. I really do. That's just... Don't do this. If you're watching this, don't do that. Don't do that. I don't know how you would do that. How would you even do that? How would you even grind your own teeth? Oh my god! I just did a little bit more digging, just to be sure. Okay, these people didn't do it to themselves. It's just that they've decided that they would prefer to get veneers rather than keeping their original teeth. So, I mean, a, a dentist did that. But still, what they were saying is that saying you don't want your teeth and getting veneers on all of them is not a not a smart thing to do. That's what they were saying, but okay. All right, just glad that we got that out of the way because I was like, oh my god. Cool. That's it. That's it for the DIY subreddit. Thanks for watching. Make sure to like if you liked. Check out the playlist in the description. If you if you want to catch more of the DIY subreddit, uh, subscribe if you're not already. Hit the bell. Last DIY video is is up there. Uh, Marin music upload down there. You can click on them. Interact event screens. Pretty swick and and quality content. QCAthletics.com. Okay. See you next time.